Hey guys, what's going on? Thanks for stopping by briefly as this is just a quick, really brief uh, update on what's going on with Airsoc. I'm your guy Grounded. And uh, there's been a lot of comments and a lot of questions and actually a lot of people that's interested in Airsoc. Um, primarily, Leeing Johnson, this request is out for you because you've, you've asked about Airsoc. So what I have here is a document from the Oregon Military Department. And if you guys don't know, Camp Riley is a military, one of the three military installations that we have here in Oregon that is publicly owned. It's managed by Oregon State Police, but it's leased, I, to my understanding, to the Oregon Military Department for its functions with the Oregon National Guard, uh, Teen Challenge, other private organizations within the state utilize uh, these, these military installations for you know, civic events, get-togethers, camping, and whatnot. But it's also a training, uh, training arena. So this document here pertains to the involvement of Airsoft. First time released right here, right now. I'll read it out to you. You guys can see it for yourself. A couple of the pertinent information has been redacted so it doesn't come back on me. So I don't get in trouble. However, you'll be able to see it. Uh, reads off, thank you for reaching out to our scheduling department regarding your desire to conduct airsoft functions at Camp Brailea. A memorandum was signed in January of 2020 by our deputy director prohibiting all non-military airsoft functions on Camp Brailea. This ruling continues to be in effect, so unfortunately, we cannot approve your request. I think I would have put a comma after, unfortunately. Whatever. So, as you can see... This, was, this came out last Friday, so that doesn't necessarily mean a no, okay? Don't take this as a no, because we have two other installations, and then there's another one in Eastern Oregon. There's Camp Whitcomb, and then there's another one in Eastern Oregon that, uh, that houses airsoft games. I mean, I, I know, I've seen it, um, and this whole thing uh, started from a post uh, that was written and, uh, on, on Airsoft Pacific, regarding the introduction of Airsoft and actually having a exclusive event. Um, if you guys are interested, you can go to airsoftpacific.com and there's a link that I'll provide at the end of this video for you guys to go view it. Um, but that's it. This is as hot as it gets. I just got my hands on it, uh, my hands on it today. So um, yeah, I'm hoping this goes through and I know there's a lot of people out there that don't want this to happen or don't believe it's gonna happen I remain hopeful that it will happen. So, oops, there goes my mic. <laughs> so I'm, I'm remaining hopeful that it will happen. So there's a couple of ways that you guys can stay in contact. Um, again, I, I'm going to reiterate, Airsoc is almost an invite-only Airsoft event that's going to be premiere. It is bringing back the old days of Airsoft. The competitiveness, the challenges, the the bravado the hoorah and and all the great stuff okay um you will hear all things relating to airsoc as soon as they come available you'll hear it through me um you can follow me to get the latest updates you can go to instagram follow it grounded tactical or you can go on facebook uh, look up grounded or grounded tactical on facebook uh, also on airsoft pacific where i'm probably going to be posting first alongside the YouTube channel for airsoftpacific.com or ultimately you can go to my website grindedtactical.com for all details pertaining to airsoc. So there it is you guys. I'll post the, the the video or a picture of the document. There it is. So let's hope that this goes through so we can have a premier area to play airsoft. Let's forget what happened in January 2020. I can't I you know, or whatever, or the events that led for them to decide. Let's put that aside. It's 2021. Let's uh, let's try to get Camp Riley back. All right. Until then, you guys, Instagram, Facebook, or airsoftpacific.com, or my website. You're on a tactical for things that's going on regarding airsoft. Until then, I'll see you guys later. I'm grounded and uh, stay frosty, and I'll keep my eye out on this.